The Okanjode Chiefs Assembly on Genocide sought President Bumba's intervention in gazetting of the motion to officially promulgate 28th May Genocide Remembrance Day. It is also the day on which the genocide victims who were kept in the concentration camps were released. This year marks 120 years of the extermination order by German colonial general Luther von Trotter to the Ovaherero and Nama communities and 116 years since the closing of the concentration camps. Cognizant of the fact that descendants of this victim of genocide we have already started to commemorate this day last year, and this year since its second commemoration, it is our wish that this year the Genocide Remembrance Day will be commemorated in nationally with the full blessing of our government, and dearly it will be an honor and privilege, Your Excellency, for you to agree this commemoration with your presence. The promulgation of the Genocide Remembrance Day has already received wide support, including from lawmakers. A day that has already been approved by the National Assembly. It was just a process that was remaining, just gazetting that was remaining. So we we'll still urge the Minister, the Honorable Your Excellency, that uh, I think we are, we are past that stage. It, what is remaining is just to be gazetted. In, in, in any setup, even in the National Assembly, not all of who agree to a particular thing. It's a normal thing. But although the majority are not always right, at times they make things easier. So if a majority have agreed to the date to accept in the National Assembly, I think what is meant just be accepted. And we shall appreciate it if it is, can be done during your time. So that one day we shall say, this day, that was bring today. We shall always remember Comrade Excellency Nangolo Pumba. That's the legacy that we want to remember you for. Just start listening. All I don't know whether I have got the right to talk about the genocide, but I've been in the game for quite some time. Uh, also coming to the day, this day that I'm talking about. You see, if our government surely and honestly adopt in a gazette this day, you will send an honest and strong message, not only to the descendants of the victim of the genocide, not only to the affected communities, but the whole world, that our government indeed, it means business about the genocide. President Bumba says the proposals by the descendants are to guide government provided that all affected parties agree. Uh, those are things we can say, let us to take, because that has to be a decision of Parliament. Amendment to adding all that, if it's agreed, but there are other people who have been proposing other, other dates, you know that. But if this is the date acceptable to all our traditional leaders, then I don't think it is necessarily a big, a big problem. Meanwhile, the annual genocide memorial service will take place on the 12th and 13th of April at Shark Island in Luderitz. The service will be held under the theme, Let the blood of our ancestors fuel our resolve for restorative justice.